today is Monday and it is the 23rd of March. Um, today I had work, I worked from home because this week I have a week at home because um, of the quarantine. So I have to stay um, at home but I did get news that I would have to go into work next week on Thursday and Friday. And um, this has caused a bit of anxiety on my end because I don't really like the idea of getting out of the house at the minute I would rather and I would feel safer if I had to stay at home and um, I also live with my parents still so yeah that out and that has shaken me a little bit because we were all set for teleworking I mean the rest of the week I will be teleworking but um, next Thursday and Friday I need to go into work so members down it and um, today I also had Gestalt online. This weekend I have on Saturday I have um, two hours as well. Um, uh, I just I don't I don't know I don't feel in the right mindset at the minute. Um, uh, last night as well I barely slept. Um, uh, I had a bit of a panic attack. <sighs> you know you, you, you think the worst, um, but it's important obviously not let fear take over because once you let fear take over then it's just going to take control and you just lose everything so i'm trying to uh, to think positive to try and continue with my day to try and relax and calm down today i did yoga i did meditation as well so uh, so i don't know maybe i don't know what to do now before i go to bed i hope i have a good night's sleep because i barely slept last night So yeah, now in Malta we've gone over the 100 cases of coronavirus in, in Malta, so we're over 100 now, but most of them, like, not most of them, sorry, like all of them are very much stable, they're also being sent home, interfering, so Malta is taking all the precautions necessary, so they're really doing a great job, you know, thank you to all the doctors, to all the nurses, to all the grocery shop owners and workers you know to everyone who's, who's still going out to work um uh, and you know especially the doctors obviously and the nurses who are the frontliners and everything of, in all of this you know um so yeah i shouldn't be complaining for just two days of going to work adapting oh this is this is the moment to adapt and um uh, yes i was a bit anxious and i had a bit of a rough rough monday i have to be honest and I'm, I'm exhausted, my, my eyes look it. <sighs> we just have to wait and see. But I hope you're all taking care of yourselves. Um, if you like this vlog, give it a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, press subscribe. And um, yesterday I only showed you my lunch, which was amazing. My normal Sunday lunch with ribs. Absolutely love that lunch. Um, but yeah, and today is Monday and tomorrow's Tuesday. So I will see you guys tomorrow. everyone so today is tuesday and it is the 24th of march i'm feeling a lot better i feel my chest is much better as well so thank god for that I'm currently drinking some lemon water so like hot water with some lemon inside of it and it's really good thanks to my dad um i have work right now um uh, it's currently quarter past 10 so i just wanted to say hello um to everyone who's working from home you know be productive guys come on let's do this and i'm just you know popping in to say hello hope you're all okay um so i'm gonna continue drinking my um tea i have to make some phone calls um uh, but yeah that's basically it so yeah my god my hair i'm so sorry but i'm going to be trying these and i said why not try them out in my vlog because my vlog isn't going to be that interesting so at least it will be interesting with these they match my nails these are the livia's dunks caramel almond swirl cookies and dip oaty cookies to dunk in a dreamy nut butter dip they're vegan gluten and dairy free as well and these i got them from flavors for health 
So they come like this. Ooh, these remind me of the cheese dippers. You know the cheese dippers, guys, where you dip those. Ooh. I'm so excited. I just can't hide it. So basically, they come like this. And I'm going to be trying them now. So I'm going to dip. <laughs> delicious <laughs> holy crew look I, I put some more some more these are brilliant guys if you want some nice gluten and dairy free snacks then get these from flavors for health because they are amazing I'm just going to continue eating these I finished work so now I'm going to prepare to start filming a video um and yeah continue my tuesday <laughs> so yeah just wanted to pop by and say a little bit of a review these are amazing i'm gonna continue eating them guys so yeah bye when nana delivers you food <laughs> by luke <laughs> luke got it for me from my nana mm. Hi everyone, I'm just using an Instagram filter because I look a mess. So today is Wednesday and it is the um, 25th of March or 26th of March. Um, uh, I finished work um, and basically I just watched um, Looking for Alaska now. I just slept. The weather as you can see is so rainy, so grey. And it just makes you want to just stay in bed. Um, I'm supposed to go have a shower now. Maybe I'll feel a little bit better. And I'm also releasing a new video today. Um, but that's basically it. That's basically, I don't feel like doing anything. Yeah, basically I just wanted to pop in and say hello. And I hope you're all doing well. And I hope you're all taking care of yourselves. Today an update on COVID-19 in Malta. Basically we had um, 19 new cases and now it's risen above 100 i think it was over 120 i'm not exactly sure i'm not really keeping track because i feel like i was getting very anxious keeping track of these things so this helps me to keep calm um, and not overload myself with too much information but you know i'm just staying home um we have a quick week of quarantine me and my family left till sunday so anyways i have work next week i have to go into work next week on thursday and friday but that's basically it and then the rest of the days i just stay home so yeah just wanted to say hi Hi. <laughs> Hi everyone. So I just had a shower. Today is when no, sorry, Thursday, 26th March. I finished work and uh, had a busy, a busy day today. And then now I had a shower and washed my hair. It's all nice. I washed my body. It's all nice and scrubbed and um, I took off my nail polish and now I'll do a new nail polish color. I'll show you what I'll do as well. But now I'm going to be using a mask. Um, I recently filmed a video on NSBA face and body and um, Andrew Barton. You'll see the video very soon. But I'm going to be trying out the first for the first time um, uh, this one. I already tried one out and I loved it. Um, and this is the NSPA Moisturizing and Hydrating Clay Mask um, in pomegranate and blackberry. So I'm going to be trying this out. Um, I just wanted to pop by and say hello. So I'm just going to set you here like this. Sorry, there's like the pixie beauty one in the way, but I don't feel like um, taking it away. Well, here we go. For you guys, I'll do you anything. I'll wash my, my face. It's okay. I'll wash my face. You know what I'll do actually? I'll use the cleanser from NSPA. So I'm gonna use this one. I've tried this one before and I love it. This is the Melting Cleansing Gel, um, a luxurious gel that turns into a cleansing milk. And I'm gonna use this. So this is from NSPA Beauty. So what I do is I'm just going to wash my hands for the millionth time, even though I'm not going out, I still wash my hands a lot. <laughs> Take a little bit of this, just a bit. Okie dokie, just 
going to place my, my um, brush because that's why I like applying masks. Oh my goodness, this smells so fruit delicious. It reminds me of like a sweet I used to take when I was young actually. Weird. So I'm just going to apply this mask. Okay, so there's my mask applied. Hmm. Now I still have left some, so I put it in a plastic bag to not waste it. Oh yeah, there's the main, the face mask applied. It's a self-care day apparently. I'm going to go and choose a nail polish now to um, paint my nails. And yeah, let me let me take you guys with me. So yeah, BRB. So these are the nail polishes I'm using right now. These are all from Revolution. Absolutely love them. I think I'm just going to take my normal pink one or else this one. I think I'm just going to use this one. This one is a shade called Lingerie and it's the one I purchased when I went to England last. Um, and I'm actually also loving the Prep and Glow base coat as well. So these are the shades that I'm going to be applying today. Nails are painted. Face mask is on. I'm going to be keeping it on for a little while because I want to just relax a little bit but yeah basically self-care thursdays right here anyways i'm going to go now i hope you all have a lovely day and i'll see you guys later bye okay hi guys um i'm talking to you again today because i think i need to um it's wednesday i'm um, sorry it's thursday still um, and um, uh, basically new laws are always coming out you know because of this covid 19 situation and one of the new laws is actually um, and that anyone who's over 65 has to stay in lockdown and basically my dad is 65 years old so so he has to stay inside i'm very very like worried about him because he's getting very frustrated as it is and we're in quarantine and we were waiting for monday to come so that he can go out again but he can't because now there's new law um, and the new law also states that people who live with people of HIV who are this vulnerable um, also need to stay inside. And so I am not going to be able, obviously, to go out. Wow, is that sauce? I don't know that sauce. Anyways, to go outside. Um, so I need to check with work. I don't know what I'm going to do. I don't know. Like, I don't have anywhere to go. Like, and I don't want to leave my family. Like, please, I don't want to leave my family. Like, I know there are places which are offering like different uh, place accommodation and stuff like that but but i can't imagine leaving I, I, like this is my like this is what gives me comfort it gives me safety like, please don't let me leave anyways so tomorrow's friday so tomorrow i'll check um, and hopefully we get it sorted anyways i hope you're all taking care just wanted to just give an update this is the reality so yeah Hi everyone, so today is Saturday and it's the 28th of March. Yesterday I didn't vlog because I had quite a tiring day. I just didn't feel like <laughs> um, coming on the camera because I would have just been like this. <laughs> so yes, um, uh, basically um, with the new news that um, anyone who's 65 has to stay at home, um, uh, even for those who they were saying that even those who are going to live with them we're gonna do lockdown but now apparently it is that you can still go and shop um for food or go to work so i think i'll still be allowed to go to work and live over here that is the most important thing that i live in my quarters these are my quarters um uh, the situation in malta i don't know like the past two days only five new cases like on thursday and friday five new cases were were um were announced so basically it's still being stabilized from as from what i could see but i mean the super the person who actually you know gives speeches and stuff like that said you know that there might be lots of people who are not going um, and reporting their symptoms so obviously if you feel any of these symptoms like a dry cough or fever or shortness of breath then you know basically just you know call 111 um anyone who's a maltese obviously and you know to get tested or something like that because you know it's it's better to get tested and to get monitored rather than to just leave it and just ignore it and um, i know it can be scary but um 
you know your health is on the line other people's health is on the line as well if you live with other people and if you're not doing quarantine or stuff like that so yeah just take care of yourselves and take care of other people so i'm about to log into um my course that clock is wrong i don't know what happened to it but then um, it's 10 a.m well should be walking into now but i'm waiting for my dad because i'm gonna go and stay in the sitting room because i'm really tired of staying in my room i'm going to stay in the sitting room but he's on a phone call with my nana so i'm just waiting for him to finish and then i go because his voice is so loud mamma mia so i'm just waiting for him to go online so yeah anyways i really don't feel like class right now i just you know i just want to chill i just want to you know today's my off day and it's just like i just want to free this brain i don't feel like gestalt i honestly don't feel like gestalt just i'm just being honest right now i'm just being honest there's too much going on there's too much heaviness there's too much i don't i'm not ready to you know get all emotional and get all into my deep inner thoughts and stuff like that i just don't feel like so yeah that's my thought anyway today is going to be the last day i don't know how saturday is going to go and um, we'll see what we'll get up to but yeah this is the week's vlog this is the last day of this week's vlog so yeah i hope you're enjoying my vlog and if you do give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more please subscribe and yeah we'll see how the day goes so yeah bye hi everyone okay so um i don't know i think my vlog never is like this but sometimes go through things in your life make you feel sad and it's okay to cry and it's okay to feel this way and maybe i just need to cry it out a little bit and i think you know showing this showing this side of me my vulnerable side is something i don't know that i never did I put down the music and um, I'm not gonna say about what it is because it's something that I want to keep personal but sometimes in life you will get these feelings um, and I know that besides <laughs> personal life you also have to deal with all of the situation that's going on and um, so it could be a lot right now because besides having the situation of coronavirus you can still be dealing with you know everyday troubles that we used to um deal with okay to cry and it's okay to feel sad sometimes so yes <laughs> um i did something that i haven't um played in a, in a long time I'm, I'm playing the sims um the sims 4 and i'm going to just spend some time playing the sims 4 because i just don't feel like doing anything else and and it honestly it made me feel good as well it's it's helped calm me down look see i'm just talking over here to you all <laughs> because i know i'm just talking to the camera but i'm actually talking to you all at the same time so yeah i just wanted to share that message take care guys